What's the crack, lads? Welcome back to the Dundee FC career mode here on EAFC 24. Um, uh, first game today, we will face off against Hearts in the Scottish Cup. But before we do that, we want to look at the standings very, very briefly here. Um, obviously, we got through a bye in the first round, so we're in the quarterfinals of the Scottish Cup. In the Premier League, or the Premiership, we are currently 8th. Um, Warren went on a bit of, bit of a poor run of results in the last game, including a 5-1 thrashing at the hands of Rangers. Um, having given them a pretty decent game only two videos ago, we ended up getting destroyed by them then in the last one. So, not a good sign. But we did get the win um, after losing four games in a row. Um, we finally got the win at the end of the last episode. So, hopefully we can continue on here, get a result against Hearts in the Cup, and maybe move on to the semi-finals, which would be a massive uh, thing here. I'm not going to take it too seriously. I probably will change the team up significantly. But I do want to win the game. And if we can, I'd be delighted to go to the semi-finals of the Scottish Cup. I don't think we've ever actually done that. So something that we can, maybe something we can look forward to or at least look at trying to do here against Hearts. Hearts right, getting behind there. Great save. Bouncing around the place and eventually a lapse in will eventually cover it good god still didn't have it there as uh but eventually he did claim it and he keep hearts out good ball in from mulligan who will he find great ball dallas first goal of the club and it's it's, it's tiffany actually thought that was dallas they have the same kind of height and hair color and boots so I thought that was uh, Dallas, but it's actually Tiffany. It's a good run here from Mulligan. Good ball in. And Tiffany will finish. It would have been nice to see Dallas get that goal, but it's actually Tiffany. And we'll take the 1-0 lead uh, after a pretty decent start by Hart. So for us to take the lead there, it's a good way to start this game. Got down the side. It's actually not a bad ball, but unfortunately not quite where you want it. We do retain the recession. It comes back to Tiffany. He gets a strike away. It's just a target. We we'll start to the second half here. Free kick in a dangerous position now. Shankland. Good play by the wall. Did their job. But now they got the corner. And they're back on level terms. Boyce with the goal. Great strike, easy save. And McKenzie is going to be back there to get it away. And great save by Alabson. And honestly, that could have been it there. And you're in. He's indeed on his bike. We actually get that throw in. The referee's going to blow it up. So I'm not quite sure what they do in the Scottish Cup. Is it penalties? Or is it a replay? Seems to be a replay. So a draw in the Scottish Cup quarterfinals. And... Looks like we're going to get a replay on this. A draw to start the video. It's not a loss. Next up is Ross County. And they are bottom of the table. Last time we faced bottom of the table. So it was St. Johnson. We lost. So I'm not going to say we're guaranteed a win here or anything. Let's just go into the game with a positive attitude. And hopefully we can get the three points. Oh, what an opportunity. Uran's not gone in his shooting boots recently. He just hasn't been able to. He, at that time, he gets into the position to score, and he just puts it off target. Something he hasn't done in a long time is get into the position to score, and he, that time he did, and he wasn't able to put it on target. There's a bit of a rust there in front of goal. Uh, 
Kane has actually won that back. Just through sheer hustle of it. Great ball. Cameron! Lovely, lovely goal. And Cameron, when he comes off the left, he can be so dangerous. And what a goal that is. Talk about just hustle to determination, doing the donkey work. And that's how we get that goal. Just excellent. And you, again, McGrath's ball there is just perfectly weighted. We've seen that from him so many times this year. And he's done it to, to Cameron numerous times even. It, Cameron coming off that left-hand side is so dangerous. Maybe it should be his full-time position. But a wonderful goal there for us to, to give us a lead. Did you give him that as a penalty? I think they are. I mean, that's a really harsh penalty if they're giving it as a penalty. They are. We've had a few of those this year, and White is just going to chip that down the middle. So, after a really nice goal by us, the referee gives Ross County a really soft penalty. They get back on level terms before the break hits. Cameron to McGrath. What can we do here, McGrath? And they're not going to get this away. And eventually it goes out for... I think the referee said that's a goal kick. I don't know about that one. That one seemed to be a corner to me. Oh, no, that was a goal kick. Fair enough. But uh, that should have been 2-1. Had an opportunity. A new rain once again can't put it away. Lovely ball, lovely chance. Pulls it back. You rain, it's still not in. Unbelievable. You rain struggling just to get the ball on target. But we're still coming forward here. No, ball goes away that time. But we. Are causing them all kinds of problems, and we need to be careful on the for the to them uh, on the counter attack as they come forward here now. It's always going to be difficult if they scramble it away. Real end to end action here. Henderson, McCown. He wants to go to the byline, but can't. Good defensive play there. Back out to Urain. What can he do? Urain! Good save again. Trying to shoot his way out of this, uh, Urain. Had a million and one chances. Cameron ball goes in. It starts. That's the opportunity that we need to score. It's Urain again. Great chance. I think anyone could argue who's had the more chances. It's us. Great ball by Urain. Can he play? No, he can't play assist either. Could he find someone in the middle? Someone would question that. Now, we, we need to be careful here because they can come forward and burn us on the counter if we aren't careful. That's what they're trying to do here now. Brown, Palace can't stop it and Henderson is on his right hand side. Portales has come across and almost got past him but Portales is still there. Cameron is over defending as well. Last thing that needs to happen is them to score and they don't. And it looks like it's going to be a draw. Indeed it will be. An end-to-end -end game that either team could have won. I, I personally think we should have won that game. We didn't. Second draw of the video. Um, honestly, that was a really entertaining game. I can't really be upset with the way that game turned out. We, all, we both had chances. Urain probably should have had a hat trick. He didn't. He's shooting boots not on at the moment, but he, they'll come back. Form is temporary. Class is permanent. We know how good Urain can be. But another draw, and honestly, uh, it's not a bad result. It's just not a good one either. Next is St. Mirren, and they're two points behind us in the table, so if they beat us, they go ahead of us. We can't let that happen. We need to beat them. I want to beat them, and... Um, it's it's we need to start get back winning again after two draws. So say Mirren away. It's going to be a difficult game, but I think we can get the re a result here. Uh, let's see who we get on.
Great opportunity. Great save from Alavson. St. Mirren did really well there. Good incisive passing, but uh, good save by Alavson. And a few shots there by St. Mirren. In the end, Olafson makes some saves. Good work forward to Robertson. Good save by the goalkeeper. Shouldn't be beat in his front post, to be fair, but it's a good save nonetheless. Oh, just off target for St. Mirren. It's going to end it all. So, what, that's three draws in a row now? At least we're getting points, but that game wasn't very good. Um, I don't remember many opportunities. That just shows you how forgettable it was. So... Not a good game there against St. Marin. They'll all, but another another point to add to, to the total. Next up, Motherwell. They're actually behind us in the table, 11th. Um, these are the games we should get and be getting results in, and we're not at the moment. So, just in a poor run of form. Um, at home this time, maybe we can get a result. We'll see how we get on. The ball. Dallas gets a strike off, but keeper saves it. But the ball was lovely there, and see what we can do from the corner. Tiffany, ball goes in. Dallas is off, but can't get it goalwards. Straight at the goalkeeper, but we can't get it away. It seems. Still can't get it away and blast it again and elapsed and saves it at his front post. Going to be a tough, tough to score from there. And if we, he did, I'd be really annoyed with Elapson, but he didn't. Now the corner. Strike and save by Elapson. Motherwell just probing again. What a save from Alavson. He came out straight away and just makes a great save. Like he strike it. It's a good save from the goalkeeper. A little bit scrappy in the middle now. We do have a corner. Tiffany's going to put that ball in. And again, scrappy, but they'll get it away. Palace. Savage. Dallas! That was actually a pass, and the keeper has to make a save. And again, we have an opportunity to get the ball in the box. Savage. Petrumbus is up. And they actually clear that away. Ball goes in again. McGee is up, and it looks like they're going to get away with it here. And Dallas does excellently to get Holland free there. No one comes with him and the goalkeeper has to save it, but probably should have pulled that one back, didn't. But again, it's a corner. Tiffany is going to take it. Ball goes in. It's to Dallas and it's cleared off the line. Still nil all. Tiffany drills the ball in again. Dallas is up again. It's back out. Savage. French. The Savage, lovely bit of feet there. It looks like this could be a uh, four draws in a row. Lovely save from Alavson. Scrappy game. It really, really is. And uh, Alavson has kept that one out there. Ball, Dallas, finish, and it's his first goal for Dundee, and it could be the winner.
McGrath with the ball again. And the finish by Dallas is excellent. And Dundee could have gotten the three points here. Cameron and McGee, or McGrath just sees Dallas. He just gets it out of his feet. And gets just enough to put the ball in the back of the net. 1-0 and that should be enough to get the result here. We just need to be defensively disciplined. Could be two here if we play this right. Dallas, it is two. And Dallas is going to bag a brace in the last 10 minutes of this game. Charlie Savage, the man who basically orchestrates that goal. He just battles there, Savage, and eventually just does the right thing. Finish that off, please, Dallas. And he does. Well done, Dallas. Two goals in his... If we're, if we waited a while for his first one. Now that the first one came, like the London buses, two have arrived. So let's see if he can still continue to bang in the goals, especially while your reign is having a tough patch in front of goal. Come on, Cleve the clean, clean sheet. Indeed we will. It's a good save. But uh, didn't get it away. Should have just booted that away because it's right about the end of the game. And French will do it for us. Callan Elliott should clear that away. And that indeed will be the end of the game. So a 2-0 victory. I uh, had only said only if, you know, 15 minutes or so before the end of the game. It looked like it was going to be another draw. But in the end, we're able to get two goals in the last 10 minutes and get a 2-0 victory. So after four games without a win we've now gone four games without a loss so that's a good turnaround you'd obviously prefer to not go on four games losing streak but if they give four game games without losing afterwards i suppose it's not too bad two two nil andy dallas is on the board for us and i think he could be a very very good signing for us if uh, if he continues to play the way he's playing and the last game before uh, of this episode is against Livingston. Now, we played Livingston recently enough and lost to them, was it 1-0, 2-0? Um, in a pretty even-ish game, I thought they were, or was that the game they, like, beat us heavily? I can't remember. <laughs> it was a boil back. Um, but we faced them again, this time at home, and possibly a, uh, that might, might mean uh, three points. So we'll see how we get on there. And the referee is going to give a penalty. Katrumbus puts the foot in. And the referee blows it. I think he... Like, it is a penalty. It's not the greatest of angles there to show it. Looks more like just the feet get tangled in, 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 in that instance. But... And save by a lapsen. So, dubious penalty. I don't know if it was that dubious, but certainly some there are going to be players that would have questioned it. But in the end, the keeper goes, saves it, and eventually we'll get it away here. Livingston come forward here now. Larson to Noble. A bit all over the place. Dundee. We're trying to keep them out. Doing an okay job some, so far, but uh, Livingston do look like they're going to get an opportunity. Good tackle there from Catrumbus. What? No, wait. Another? That's not a penalty. There's no way that's a penalty. He got the ball. That doesn't show it very well there, but second penalty, and Noble misses again. Ball does not lie, but I need to see this. I need to see this penalty. To me, he gets the ball. You might have a different opinion, but we're going to see this in the replay here. Is this a penalty? Leave leave, leave your comments here. Well, in full time, I said no. Let's see if I'm right here. He gets a foot in there and gets the ball. That's not a penalty for me. Just It's just not for me. Another bad decision by the referee. Not really had many chances today, but finally we come forward. It's Cameron. He's actually got some space. Got someone on the outside there. Looks like it's McCown. 
there. A little bit of a tight angle for him, but he gets it in! Probably not deserved, but after all the bad luck we've had today with penalties, maybe luck is starting to even itself out. McCown give us, gives us a lead with 15 minutes left to go. It's a decent run by Cameron. It's just a counter-attack, simple as. The keeper should never get beaten from there, but he does. We'll take the lead. Possibly not really something we deserve, but we'll take it nonetheless. Rain there, trying to give a tackle. Oh, that's a bad challenge. No doubt he's getting a yellow card here. And deservedly so. That's a late challenge from behind. And a red. A straight red. I understand it's not a, a great challenge. and It's late. It's from behind. That's a big decision to make here from the referee, but... Last few moments here as we need to defend. That's actually a really good ball, but Alavson gets across and saves it with his foot there. Hoofed away there from Dundee. Now we've got only a few moments left, surely. Where's that whistle referee? But nothing yet. Strike. Excellent save from Alavson again. Where's the, where's the, the final whistle? Holding on here with 10 men. Ball goes in. If we defend this, we probably get away with it. The header is not away from us. Ball back in. Goes into the air and it ends up in McKenzie's uh, chest. And he will clear it away. And that will be the end of the game. Referee gave Livingston more than enough opportunities there at the end to get that equaliser. And after a really poor... Um, performance by the referee two penalties that i think the first one you could argue was a penalty the second one was never a penalty not in a million years and a red card everything was going against us today but we end up getting the win anyway big win here for us one nil but we do lose your reign as he will be suspended however that's all we have time for here in today's video we are currently seventh with 35 points we are five points behind um, Hearts and four points behind Livingston who are in the top half of the table. Um, probably not going to get into there, but if we did, it would be a massive achievement to go from one of the worst teams in, in the, the division to get into the top half for the second stage in their second one. Um, but as I said, that's all we have time for. I hope you guys enjoyed and please like and subscribe and um, there'll be more content for you coming up. Peace out, guys. Have a great day.